it's just it's such a it's such an important essential part of our growth and our lives i i i mean i don't feel a need to make blanket statements or say what the future is going to be like and also i really want to say that i just imagine we're going to continue to embrace this freedom Our membership site is growing and we want you to be a part of it. We have over a hundred videos, so many exercises, tons of ways for you to learn, grow, heal, and inspire with us. Come on over and see what it's all about. Hey beautiful people, my name is Brittany. And I'm Connor. And today we're going to be answering a question that we got in response to our pregnancy announcement. Got a lot of these questions. Yeah, this is a really common question. Hot topic. Hot. Are we still going to be having like a polyamorous open style relationship? With a baby. With a baby. Growing inside of you. With a pregnant Outside belly. of you. <laughs> Am I going to be getting frisky with a big belly? Yes. yes. Yeah, absolutely. Definitely. Yeah, we don't have any plans to alter our relationship. Um, you know, our relationship just kind of alters itself. Wow, and it really does. That's that's part of what we uh, really love about having a free style relationship. And you can kind of call it whatever you want, but for us, it's really about freedom. We don't have any rules. We don't have any obligations to one another that we say like, we're going to do this thing. Yeah. And if not, then that's it. We just kind of like communicate a lot about our needs and our wants and our desires. And um, yeah, we definitely don't have any, any plans on trying to conform that into maybe a, a monogamous style relationship. No, and I feel like you hit on it when you said the freedom. That The freedom element of what we're doing feels so important to me. I feel like it didn't work for me in previous relationships to feel confined, and it permeated like all sorts of areas of my life in a negative way, I found. Yeah, me too. And that's just for me and for you. And uh, Yeah, that's not for everybody. This is really, we're just talking about us. And so it's kind of like, it's not, it's, it's so much, it feels like so much more than like, are we going to be poly still? It's like this core need to have freedom and full self-expression. And that's, like you said, it's always transforming what our relationship looks like mm -hmm. based on our needs and how we're growing and what's coming up for us and... It's just, it's such a, it's such an important essential part of our growth and our lives. I, I, I mean, I don't feel a need to make blanket statements or say what the future is going to be like. And also, I really want to say that I just imagine we're going to continue to embrace this freedom mm -hmm. in our lifestyle <clears throat> forever. And that doesn't even mean that we're going to be... That we'll have um, other partnerships outside of our partnership forever. I really don't know. Could go, could go any direction. And you know, we're not. Uh, yeah, we just don't make claims about that kind of stuff. Like I really have the intention of loving you and being with you and being the the primary caregiver to this amazing human being that we're growing yeah. together. You know, and I really have such a need and a, and a desire to have you as a partner you yeah. know and i really want to support you and, and meet your needs so that so that you feel you know like you want me as a as a partner and that we can do this together yeah. and that's the place that i'm coming from i don't i don't feel like i need uh, uh certain restrictions or obligations or kind of contractual agreements with you in order to to have those needs met and everything's changing, you know, we, all of us humans are just so, we change, you know, we evolve and it makes sense that what worked today may not work tomorrow. And that's part of why we keep this open and free yeah. because we keep our dialogue up to date, you know, yeah. <laughs> we talk about what yeah, we're feeling totally. today, pretty much on the daily. And we check in about needs and wants and desires and that's how we stay close, you know? Yeah, I think that there are some things that are, uh, people may wonder what it looks like, you know, when, when we are pregnant or when we have a child. And I feel like we're so excited about <laughs> dedicating so much energy mm. to this being. So yes. being united around caregiving for this being is such a huge part. Huge. And that also includes caregiving for ourselves and mm -hmm. one another. It's mm -hmm. really like this beautiful 
it feels like it's all connected. Yes. Yeah. Um, there is a word that sometimes comes up. Oh, committed, you know? Yeah. That um, sometimes there's a, a bit of a confusion or an assumption that uh, maybe an open relationship or a polyamorous relationship doesn't have levels of commitment. That commitment is not part of the equation. And that really doesn't resonate with me at all. I feel hugely, massively committed to Brittany. I feel so committed to caring for you and to loving you and supporting you. Yes. And I also feel really committed to Connor and supporting me and loving me. And I also feel so committed to this little one that we're growing. And, uh, and those, are, those are the three kind of pillars of my life right now. And external relationships outside of that are wonderful. And if they enhance our, our dynamic, my dynamic, um, I totally want to invest energy into that but not at the, at the level of compromising the type of care that I need to express to Brittany, to this child, to myself, and so on. So that's, so that's where I'm coming from as an individual. I'm not saying this is how it is for every free open relationship that's having a child or however you want to look at it, but that's personal, you know, it's personal reflection. And that this can mean that for me. It means I can be very committed in a way that also feels like it, it has freedom. And it has the, the ability to evolve naturally. And I noticed that the, the people that we welcome into our lives are always in alignment with the growth that we're doing. It's always because it feels right. Mm. And I feel like that's going to continue to unfold and is continuing to unfold. Absolutely. So the people that we are sharing more space with during this pregnancy, and I imagine during the time that this child is out in the world, it's just going to be in ways that really add, add value and love and light to their life mm. and to our lives. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. And that's just the bottom line for everybody who's asked us different questions over time, like, will it be good for the child mm -hmm. or like how it's just like, we are so attuned to that, to what feels good for us, yeah. for those around <clears throat> us, that is top priority. And I think that like our level of commitment to this child uh, is immeasurable. I mean, it's, it's so gigantic and massive. Um, I just don't take it lightly. Yeah, like we've yeah, put so yeah. much a attention uh -huh. on when was the right time for us to do this, being completely sure that this is what we want and that we will like prioritize that. And create the healthiest environment that we possibly can. Of course, you know how you know what that looks like for different people is gonna be different, but for us, our intention is like it's so clear. We have a very clear path. That we're open to, you know, changing as it makes sense. But the point is that, uh, like, our energy, our focus, uh, our vision is all about creating this beautiful, healthy, sustainable environment for this little one. For them, for us, for everybody else involved, that's a part of our lives. Yes. Yeah. Because it all, it's all the same thing, really. Yeah. It all, you know, feeds itself. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, that's that's where we're at. And we really appreciate these kinds of questions. They're so Can fun for us. Definitely keep asking them. Yeah, and if you like this video, feel free to give it the thumbs up or if you want to share it with somebody that helps Super us helpful. spread the message that feels so good for us. Yeah, thanks y'all. We'll see you soon. Okay. Bye. Bye.